Welcome back to another one of my mathematics tutorials. In this session, we will be looking at how to simplify algebraic expressions. On screen, there are a couple of expressions. Let's look at the first one. 6a plus 12 plus 2a plus 5. Now, the first thing you want to do is circle all of your terms. And when I am circling my terms, I circle the sign in front of it as well. So I know what type of term it is, whether it is positive or negative. Now for that first term, remember, if it is positive, there would not be a sign in front of it. It's going to be understood that it is positive. Now, secondly, what you want to do is rearrange your terms such that like terms go together. Remember, like terms are those terms where your variables are the same. And when I say the same, you must also have the same powers in order for it to be like terms. So, here I am seeing 6a and 2a being like terms. So, I can write 6a. And when I'm putting that 2a, that positive sign goes in front there as well. And 12 and 5 are just numbers. So those could be combined. And I will write those together. That plus 12, plus 5. And now I am going to simplify it by performing the operations. So 6a plus 2a is going to give me 8a. Positive 12 plus 5 is going to give me positive 17 and that's it there that is how you simplify that next i am going to circle these now we are seeing that i have 5d and 4d here so i'm going to combine that those are like terms so it's going to be 5d I'm going to carry that sign for before that 4D, which is a positive. Then I'm going to put the, the Y's together. Remember, that's positive 8Y and negative 2Y. So now I am going to perform my operations. Now that I have all like terms together. So it's going to be 5D plus 4D. That is 9D. That's positive 9D. Remember, I don't write that plus sign in front there because that's my first term and that's positive. Then positive 8 take away 2 is going to give me positive 6Y. So your answer 9D plus 6Y. Next, circle your terms. So I have here four terms. I'm going to bring my like terms together. So it's going to be 17e take away 4e plus 16 take away 3. And that is going to give me 17 take away 4 is going to give me 13e. And positive 16 take away 3 is going to give me positive 13. Next, circle my terms. Bring your like terms together. And fortunately, in this question, our like terms are already together. I see H's together and I see U's together. So I'm just going to combine them using my operations. Positive 7, take away 3 is going to give me positive 4H, 5U, positive 5, plus 2 is going to give me positive 7U, right? Next, I'm circling my terms. Now it's getting a bit jumbled as I'm circling all of my terms. So 7V and positive 3V, I can bring that together. So it's going to be 7V plus 3V 
and then I'm going to put my A's together, positive 6A, take away 2A. So this now is going to combine 7 plus 3 is going to give me 10V, and positive 6, take away 2, is going to give me positive 4A. Next, circle those terms. So we have J's and T's. So let's put, we can put T's first. So it's going to be 9T plus 2T. Then J's, positive 5J, take away 2J. So it's going to be 9 plus 2 is 11T. And positive 5 take away 2 is positive 3G. Next, circle your terms. So here now we have R's and S. So we're going to put the R's together, which is already together, so that's good, and our S's are already together, so we can perform our operations. So 13 take away 5 is going to be 7 R and positive 9 take away 2 is going to be positive 7 S. Next, circle my terms and here now you are going to get our M's are already together and our N's so here it's going to be 3 M plus 6n. That positive 8, take away 2, positive 6. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to circle the other terms and I'll meet you back. So I have circled out all my terms there, so it's going to make it a little easier. 2a plus 4a is going to give me 6a. And then I put back my positive 3y. So there's no other y's. So I just put that y, 3y there. Next, 7, take away 2. So that's a negative 2c. So it's going to be 7. Take away 2 is 5c. And there's no other w. So I put back my 9w. Next, 4e, take away 2e is going to give me positive 2e and I put back my plus 3u. Next, 15g take away 10g is positive 5g and I put back my take away 3s. Next, let's see. This one has five terms. So we have 12p, so I'm going to write it here. 12p, I'm going to put my p's together take away 2p and then there's that p at the end plus 4p and now I'm going to put my q's together plus 9q take away 3q. Now I can combine 12 take away 2 that's 10 and 10 plus 4 is 14p 9 take away 3 is positive 6 Q. Next, 19J take away 3J plus 2J. I'm going to write that 19J take away 3J plus 2J. And then I'm going to put my N's together plus 10N take away 9N. And it's going to be 19 take away 3 is 16 and 16 plus 2 is 18. So that's 18J. And positive 10, take away 9, is going to give me positive 1G. Remember, you can always omit that 1. So you can just write your G. It's understood that 1 is before a letter that doesn't have a number in front of it. Next, we have K's and M's. So we're going to combine our k's. It's 13k plus 
3k. Now we're going to put our m's plus 11m. Take away m. And then we're going to put that. Take away 1. So 13 plus 3 is going to give me 16k. And 11, positive 11, take away 1. Remember, 1 is understood to be here. So it's going to be positive 11. Take away 1 is positive 10m. And I put back my negative 1. Next, I have z's, y's, and that number there. So I'm going to put my z's, 6z, take away, sorry, plus 3z. And now I'm going to put my y's. This here is a plus. So it's going to be plus 9y. Take away 4y. And then I'm going to put back my take away 4. Let's combine. 6 plus 3 is 9z. Positive 9. Take away 4. That's going to be positive 5y. And then take away 4. And there you have it. Your simplification of algebraic expressions. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more of my videos.